Are you playing Nekopara? No, I'm not playing that. I'm playing my Nintendo Game and Watch. Nyom. Look at this. We got a Nintendo Super Mario Brothers Game and Watch. It's kind of pog. I haven't opened it yet. So we're going to go into this bad boy together. This is a limited edition Game and Watch. And there's a lot of Easter eggs and stuff on it. I might cover those at some point. But let's see here. How does this... Oh, uh, does this just slide? How does this... Oh, there's tape on this side. I see. I see what you're trying to do. I see what you're doing. There's tape over here. There we go. Okay, there we go. Oh, and there's tape on this side too. Haha. <laughs> oh, that's cool. So the little... Little plastic store case actually has like stickers on it. That's cool. I like that. So even like the store hanger thing is savable. But here's the box. It's a pretty normal looking box without without all this stuff on it. But this shows the four modes that it has. We'll go into that in more detail. I just want to get this bad boy open. Hopefully it's charged. So let's let's find out. We already cut the teeth, yeah. And then ah, oh, ooh. Look at that. Look at that beauty in there. Okay, here we go. Ooh, that's a charging cord. That's not too beauty. It's papers. Ooh, instructions on how to use... Get out of here, skizzers. I don't need you. We have USB-C. And then... We have the bad boy itself. Right here. Ooh, look at that. Is that in there? That's it. Look at that. It's tiny. I mean, it is a Game & Watch. Ooh, look at that. Look at that. Hi. Oh, that is nice. The buttons feel kind of weird. Let's see here. Is there a power? Probably has to be charged. Oh, there is a power button here. Oh, no, it works. Look at that. Nice. What does it want? Press time button. Ooh, and there's sound. Do you hear it? You can barely hear it. But it's there. Oh, you can change the time wallpaper thing. Is it actually noon? No, it's wrong. I don't know how to set... Oh, set time. There we go. What time is it? 12.26. It's close. There we go. Look at that. Can we control the time? No. Let's see here. Game. So we have three options of game. We have Super Mario 1. If you can see that. Focus. Focus. Super Mario 1, 2, and Ball. Let's go to Ball. So we have Game A and Game B. Let's do Ball. I kind of suck at Ball. It's been a long time. Okay. Nice. Look at that. We're balling. Yo, we're balling right now. Okay, and then get that one. So it's just how many times can you juggle? That's uh, uh, this is exciting stuff for for people in the 1980s. This is this is exciting stuff. Let's go back to the games here. Let's play a real game. Let's play Mario Super Mario Brothers in real life. Let's see what we got here. Oh, this is hard. Oh, it's so tiny. Oh, it's so tiny. New? Oh, it's so tiny. It's not, it's not bad. But it is really small. Like, it looks kind of big in, in camera. But look at it compared to my hand. Like... It's actually super small. So here's just a Game Boy Advance that I have on hand. Just Pikachu one. But look at the size of this compared to the Game Boy Advance. And people think the Advance is small and hard to do. Look at the size of this thing. This thing is... Even, the screen looks... The screen is smaller, I think. Yeah, the screen is smaller than the Advance. And it's so small. Look at this. Look at the button. Look at the D-pad. 
The D-pad's pretty much the same size, actually. The buttons are rubber, which is different from the, this it's plastic, which is kind of nice. But it is super, super small. Alright, let's continue our Mario adventure. Blurred out, because who needs to see Mario in focus? Super Mario in focus on camera! Oh my word, this is, this is harder than you think. Just because I can't really run and jump at the same time. We're almost done with the level anyways, so. But, man, this thing is teensy-weensy, itsy-bitsy, yellow polka dot bikini. Ah, uh, that's fine. Then we have Mario Bros. 2, which is not the Mario Bros. 2 we know, but this is Mario The Lost Levels. So, which was called Mario Bros. 2 in Japan, but we didn't get that game until Lost Levels. So, we're gonna play 1-1. One, one. We're just gonna play through a bit. I have not played this game before, actually. So this is my first time. My first time ever playing Mario 2, and I got killed by a mushroom. That's a great start. That's a fantastic start right there. This, this just shows that I need to play Mario... Oh, there's a real mushroom. So there's evil mushrooms. This game was known for being a troll. That's one reason it wasn't released in the West, because the game was too hard for people, they thought. So, yeah. That, that's, that's Mario 2. And those are all three games on the system. So, first thoughts. 50 bucks. It feels nice. It's kind of small. If anything, people won't actually play on this. It'll just be a collector's item. It'll sit up next to my, my other rare consoles. But would I suggest getting it? Eh. If you really want it, it's 50 bucks. You could get a whole new Switch game for that much. But it's not bad. It is nice. It is a good collector's item. We don't know how many there are going to be, but it is a limited edition. And hey, you can you can you can tell time on it. You can have this on, as a clock. Okay, can you do that with your Super Nintendo? I don't think so. So that's that's the Mario Brothers game and watch. If anything, I just get it for this. This looks pog. Like, look at that. Just the plastic store cover thing is nice looking. So there. That's that's the Mario Bros. game and watch for ya. So what do you think about the Mario game and watch? Let me know in the comments down below. And thank you for watching. I'll see you all next time.